and welcome back to my channel. I am Simply Brentley. Don't forget to get your energy in and like, comment, and subscribe for all of your manifestation needs as well as the personals. Head on over to my website, energyllc.com. The link will be in the description box below. Holy Father, angels, ancestors, speak through me. If I reach one person and one person alone, which I know I will, please and thank you. All right, let's go ahead and ground. This is for the collective. I want to say thank you to every single person that has been showing me love and support. I appreciate every single one of you guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you. This got on my lap, eight of wands. So fast, movement, progress. Okay. For some reason, I just got action and satisfaction. Then we have juggling and also page of swords. Okay. So, and what is this that fell on the ground? It is in reverse. The hangman in reverse. Okay. Okay. So, there's some fast movement coming. Somebody that definitely was um, trying to priority, prioritize or had a problem prioritizing in the past. Um, somebody that was very deceitful, very manipulative towards you. Um, and they were, they have a guilty conscience at this time. They have a guilty conscience at this time. The, like, hold half of that just, like, fell in my lap. Let's see what all of these are. We have the four of cups. Yeah, they've been discontent. They've been very discontent. They've been very bored without you. They haven't been doing nothing but thinking about you, wondering what you're doing, having constant thoughts, having constant reminders, all of that shit. Right? Just saw one, four, four. So they know you're chosen. And um, they want to definitely want to visit you. We have the Page of Cups here. They want to show you some type of love. They want to show you some type of emotional connection, which they were withdrawn from before. But now they want to show that that they know who you are. They know that you're not just going to take any type of shit, right? They know you're very valuable. And they know that you deserve the truth. They know that you des you deserve equality. They deserve that you deserve um, justice, right? And fairness and truth and all that shit, right? Um, but there's been a lot of tension in this. Five of Swords. There's been a lot of tension. And through this tension, this person has been up in their head. They, they don't know how to approach you. They don't know how to come forth correctly. They don't know how they're going to allow me to reintroduce myself. So this person is like trying to reinvent themselves, trying to come to fuck correct. They're trying to, you know, come at you a different way. Because they know who the fuck you are. You're a motherfucking star. With you is bright prospects. With you is... um very much so happiness and joy and all of that shit. And you're a very optimistic person. So even like whenever you're on the lowest of lows, you have those those down moments. We all have those down moments. But you're going to snap the fuck out of it and be like, okay, this shit happened for a reason. Nothing is a coincidence. Let's see how we can move on from here. Period. And you've been celebrating lately. You've been celebrating lately. You've definitely been healing as well. So as you're healing, you become more attractive. And then we have the Ace of Pentacles. Yeah, you're a very powerful manifester. And with you is prosperity. And you're a very secure person. And then right over the fast movement, this person knows good and damn well that there's been a lot of conflict. There's been a lot of heartbreak in this situation. That's why they don't know how to come forth. They've been doing a lot of research. They've been doing a lot of studying. They've been doing a lot of planning because they have to get their confidence up because they feel like they have this one opportunity to come forth and the one opportunity that they have, they don't want to fuck it up, right? Fuck it up, fuck it up. They they want to make sure they come correct. They want to make sure that they, you know, this, op okay, I have like a moment like this. Some people wait a lifetime. Y'all know. Anyway, so like, they, they feel like this lifetime connection, this counterpart connection, they have this one moment like this to come forth and come forth correct, right? Because with you is the sun. It's the sun. It's hope. It's vitality. It's happiness. It's health. It's understanding. It's achievement. All of that shit, right? And you're going to have your boundaries up, and you should. Stand your motherfucking ground. Be who you are. Let them know I ain't taking no shit, period. Ten of cups, but this could definitely be a happy situation. So you have to just get it all out, you know, in the open. Figure the shit the fuck out and, and, you know, have a grown adult, effective communication type of conversation. Leave nothing out. Like, no question is too little. No question is dumb. We hear that shit all the time. What, whatever. It, no, like, thought in your head, that imaginary thought that, that you may have made up in your head, like, back and forth either way, you know? Take it how it resonates, vice versa, you know what I'm saying? So, like, whatever way it may have gone, it, it's like... All that shit just needs to get out in the air. Then we have temperance. 
We have temperance. We have balance. We have you being very, very patient in this connection. And you them, you know, also understanding that it's all about self-control. That it's all about compromise. It's all about blending and adapting and understanding, you know, different ways people love to be loved, right? Understanding each other. Keep getting to have that deeper connection so that you know. Public recognition, yeah. So this is definitely a winning situation, right? With progress, with working on it. With working on it, right? Uh, the, they see you winning by yourself. They want to join you and win it. Then we have the chariot, lovers, the moon, judgment, eight of cups, and ten of pentacles. So yeah, this person definitely wants to go in. They want to come in, go in, okay? They want to go in on you with something like, they want to partner with you. They want to partner with you. They want to reconcile. They want to go ahead and show you the balance. They want to... They they know that this is like a deep soul connection. They know that this is there's some type of practical grounds that could be had with you too. They know good and damn well that they're. I just have like an overwhelming feeling of love that was given to this person and just a rush of love. You know, like just a rush of love, and they just want to be in their comfortable place. They just want to be in their comfortable place, and they want to get to know you even more, right? Then we have the moon. So there is still some anxiety here. There's still some up in your headness here on both sides, right? Whether you should accept this person back, like if they come, are they going to come fucking correct? Whether, you know, are they playing games? Are they being honest, right? It's going to be up to your discernment. A spiritual awakening um, has been, you know, happening. And this person does want to heal and change and reevaluate. And I feel like, like they're seeing some shit on a whole new level now. They're hearing some shit on a whole new level now. It's not on the same level that they was previously. It's like some shit that has awakened and it's like, okay, my ears are open even more. I see that deep, that deep like evolution of self, right? And having to work on yourself and having to grow and having to understand that everything happens for a reason reason and having to having to understand that that unconditional love and that deep soul connection and that partnership to create that empire right what you were searching for what you were yearning for that empty piece that it always felt like it was there was always in front of you and you just need to reciprocate that and then you can go ahead and understand and connect and this very electric connection and and you know this past life connection and understand that with us growing with us learning with us you know, feeding each other is like just beautiful. Feeding each other the knowledge and connecting, we get to teach other people, right? We get to teach other people. And as we teach other people, that's what it's all about, showing the unconditional love and spreading it. To lead to this Ten of Pentacles situation, happiness, achievements, all of that, history, like that's that generational shit. All right, all right, all right. Don't forget to get your energy in and like, comment, and subscribe. And I'm, I'm going to go ahead and stop because Spirit's like, okay. Uh, the last thing is like this person is letting go. They're leaving the past in the past. They're abandoning situations that no longer serve them. They're changing their priorities. And they know they have to go the fuck on with what, you know, what they know is their true, what they're true in line with. Look, cut the deck on deep knowing. So they deeply know that this connection has something that has not been settled and they want to work on it and be flexible within the whole situation. All right. Yes, 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 yes. Thank you, every single person. I appreciate every single body. Thank you. Don't forget to get your energy in and like, comment, and subscribe. For all of your manifestation needs as well as for personals, head on over to my website, energyllc.com. The link will be in the description box below. As always, peace. Love and namaste.